similar words and expressions. So two different expressions that we have for B-O is stank, which is typically the past tense of stink, but is also used informally to describe an unpleasant smell. And we've also got the stench of decay, which refers to the smell of a dead animal or human undergoing the process of decay. So this, we would use this to describe someone who is very, who has really bad B.O. So we're going to start with stank. Um, we've got two sentences. Somebody in here has some serious stank. And you should wash that funky stank off your body. So again, this can this here can follow the same pattern as BO. Now the stench of decay is going to be a little different. So let's start with our first sentence. Somebody in here has the stench of decay. So we want to start with the word somebody or someone. And then you can say in here or around here after the subject. And then you want to say has the stench of decay. Now the second sentence is he should wash that stench of decay off his body. So here we can use the subject first. So that can be he, she, I, or you. And... Then you can use should wash or needs to wash. Um, and then you can use the stench of decay off and then the possessive my, your, his, her. And then from there you can use body. So yes, he should wash that stench of decay off his body.